Casey, since the moment I met you in 10th grade math class, I knew you were special. You had this thing about you, the charisma, the dimples, the glow. You were dreamy. You are dreamy. Life with you is a dream, and I'm the luckiest person alive to be living that dream every waking moment. I had the honor of being the first girl to come into his life that he chose to unconditionally love. Other than, or I guess including a few bloody noses and punches to the arm, I can say with all honesty, I feel that love every day with Timmy, which made it so easy to always look up to him as my big brother. I can say with confidence, though, that I would be more than content to be half the person that Timmy is today. I would say the one thing I would spend every day aspiring to do is to find someone as perfect for me as Casey is for Timmy. I remember falling in love with you quickly and deeply. At 15, I was definitely not looking for my future husband. You stole my heart with your winks across the hallway and your post-school texts with math homework answers. <laughs> Casey was getting ready to go to the football game and she came downstairs in a football jersey. And it was the first time any of my children had worn a football jersey. And then I looked at her and I thought, wait, that means that you like that person. Casey, do you like that person's jersey? Like whoever's jersey that is? And she looked at me and she turned the darkest shade of red and she said, I don't know, and she ran out the door. He was sitting in the back seat, Maddie and I were in shotgun, and he said, hey, I want to tell you guys something. And Maddie and I are like, what's up? He's like, I have a crush on Casey Kaiser. I'll always remember all the way back when high school Casey would come upstairs and her face would be all red from Timmy's beard scratching or when they were kissing. <laughs> and then I remember meeting Casey. I remember meeting Casey on her first date with Timmy. I was like driving Miss Casey. I only saw Casey from the rear, you know, from the rear of your mirror and I'm like, oh my God, they look so happy and fun and so young and, and just, just happy. And uh, you know, you didn't know then where it was gonna be now, but you're talking many years ago. Casey is someone you need on your side. I know Timmy, my family, friends would all agree she's the most loyal person you'll ever meet. Casey was always there to help me and pick me up when I needed it. I never had to ask, she just did it. And not only is Casey perfect for Timmy, she just is perfect. <laughs> and I know everyone can agree. She has the most beautiful heart that I even could recognize at the age of 10, and I've never forgotten since then. Her presence quite literally lights up every square inch of any room she's in, and she takes care of every single one of her people, no matter what the cost. She never fails to put others before her, and is unconditionally giving for the people she really loves. So, Timmy, you're in good hands, too. In life, Timmy is my rock. Uh, we've had a lot of up and downs. He's always had my back. Um, the twists and turns, I've been blessed to um, have best friends and brothers all wrapped up into one. Anyone who knows him uh, would agree that he's an exceedingly polite and respectful young man. I think without exception, all of our friends would say the same thing every time they came after they met him. Timmy, you have this understanding of how to show love that I think some people never learn. And you have only grown in your capacity to show it. You are the kindest, most patient, consistent, hardworking, loving, and dedicated person. He's always been an older brother to me, but he's always been a mentor, a protector, and most importantly, my best friend. Um, and today, being able to stand by his side is an honor. Um, I couldn't be more proud of the man he's become and the love he's found with Casey. You are the love of my life, my rock, my teammate, my fierce, fierce opponent sometimes. My shoulder lean on, my voice of reason, my absolute best friend. Timmy, to be standing up here today will forever be my favorite memory. Today is the day I become your wife and partner. You're forever. The day I get to promise to you our future. You are you fully through, no matter the situation. Through hardship, through pain, through the lows of all lows. Through joy, through laughter, through the highs of all highs, you are you. You are the type of person who makes someone feel seen. Your soul is as pure as your heart. You are authentically kind, one of the kindest I've known. You are smart, you are patient, you are consistent, you are safe.
when you first met in the 10th grade, sharing both math and history classes. You didn't say much to each other, but you definitely noticed each other. The moment you started spending more time together in class, you never ran out of things to share with each other. Tim was so kind and funny, charming and charismatic. He was infinitely easy to talk to. When he asked you to wear his football jersey, you said yes. And by your first date, you were head over heels and Tim's heart was full just being around you. I promise to love you with my whole heart, unconditionally and without judgment. I promise to care for you whether you are sick or healthy. I promise to always apologize for my wrongdoings. I promise to cherish you for who you are, not for who I want you to be. As I look into your beautiful brown eyes today, I see the future we've dreamed about and talked about since we were just 15. I see us traveling the world together and hitting all the dots on the map that you made in high school of all the places we want to visit. I picture us singing in the car, holding hands, as we will see all, these, see all this big, beautiful world has to offer. Today, we would also like to acknowledge that our circle here is bigger than those of us who are gathered, for the energy of our departed loved ones remains with us. You were able to meet her mom. Um, it was obviously brought up a ton of times this weekend, um, but it was truly special for you get to, to get to meet her. Um, I could tell right away when you met her that she loved you and she knew how perfect you were for Timmy. I know that my mom is smiling down knowing that you were the one taking the title of Mrs. Duran. I love you, Casey Julia, more than words can ever express. I will live happy for all my days left, knowing I have you until death do us part and thereafter. I love you. You are officially and forever husband and wife in the sight of all people. You may now seal and celebrate your vows with a kiss. She was born with this undeniable gift of knowing what's right for her. And Timmy, you are, and you always have been, the most right for her. My sister is a bright, brilliant, passionate person, and I couldn't imagine a more perfect match for her than Tim. Was quickly introduced and immediately like had made an impact on all of us. She met all my cousins, all my family, and like immediately blended in. Like it's the coolest thing ever. I tell it to everyone. He never failed to entertain and he never failed to show love, which is how I knew uh, Casey was in good hands. Casey, you are truly um, so radiant and kind, fun and amazing human being um, that has brought so much joy to Timmy's life. Um, everyone who knows you is truly lucky to know you and from the moment you joined the family it was clear that you were a perfect match for Timmy in every way. 